Good evening, I'm Lee Anderson. The mother of a 17-year-old boy killed in a crash over the summer is now suing two of his friends and four others. Bola Badabo is here with the details. Bola. Lee, the mother of A.J. Clow is suing several others that her lawyer believes all played a part in why he's not here today. It's been nearly six months since the death of 17-year-old Anthony Clow, known as A.J., a former Mountain View student. He was a passenger in a vehicle while the owner, who investigators say was intoxicated, was doing donuts at Wikiup Reservoir in June. The vehicle flipped over, trapping A.J. underwater. Now his mother, Linnell Clow, has filed a $34 million lawsuit against six defendants. Back in June, A.J.'s mother shared with News Channel 21 just how much she misses him. The hardest part of losing a child is living every day after. The defendants include the driver and the teen that allegedly bought the alcohol. The U.S. Forest Service, the U.S. Bureau of Reclamation, the North Unit Irrigation District, and Walmart are also named. The Ben Walmart is named in the lawsuit for allegedly selling alcohol to an underage teen. Lawyer Emmanuel Miller is working on the case and says reckless behavior has been going on unchecked at the reservoir for a long time. He says it is, in part, responsible for why AJ is not here today and for the pain it's costing the Clow family. Less than probably forever will be the worst day of my life. The lawsuit alleges negligence as well as expenses related to medical and funeral costs. Miller says it's the community that let A.J. down, leading to his death. Police say the driver has failed many drunk driving tests. Lee?